Okay, I'm John. And I'm Dash. We're in Unit 6. This is the Krang Podcast. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Expertly done there. Uh, I'm with John and Dash. Sorry. John, John and Dash. Dash. <laughs> John and Dash. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> here I am with Josh and Dan of You Made Six. Uh, we're standing outside of Funeral Barracks. There's every chance there's a few dead bodies piled up in the uh, shutters. So, uh, how are you doing? Good. Not dead, I'm alive, which is good. You look very tan. Oh, it's been a holiday. Yeah, where have you been? The Walking. sun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, it was, yeah. It was, uh, it's actually winter there at the moment, so it's a bit cold. But right. It wasn't too bad. Sure. Do you have a bikini line or anything? I've got. Do you look at look at the tan? Oh, oh that on. Look at that tan line. This won't even appear on oh, the podcast as far as our camera Dan, so Personal personal files. Yeah. So um, tonight you're playing uh, the Barfly as part of the Crying League of Rock with Roll Tomasi and Frank the Way. Yeah. Uh, how have you? What kind of things have you done in preparation for tonight? Um, well, we did some warm-up shows on the weekend. Yeah. And where were they and how did they go? Uh, Mini Fist and Trowbridge. Mini Fist? Mini Fist and Trowbridge. Mini Fist. It was alright. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's a hard show for Bournemouth. Yeah, it was a weird one. Yeah, um, yeah yesterday. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of fists rolling around. But no, it was, it was a really weird setup, but it's like in a leisure centre. I don't know, I think kids are finding it hard to kind of get an atmosphere going because it was cons- um, continuously like, swapping from one stage to the other. That'll be the bands you have to wear to go in the pool. It's <laughs> yeah. Luke, you know? yeah, no, so no. just no oh, petting allowed in the pit, or bombing, or bombing. Uh, cool. So um, you're doing a tour in October, starting the 15th with through some calls on farewell. Yeah. Uh, in support of your new album, Take Off the Colours. Yes. Could you tell us um, the sort of story behind the title? Anything to do with pubs and football? Um, this came out so this was this was ages yeah, ago, wasn't it? We were back in Leeds, and um, you've got to say the whole thing about the film, right? Well, really? All right. Well, you can tell a bit about the film. Okay. Cool. Uh, you've seen the film The Warriors? Yes. There's, um, you know the scene where the warriors are walking through the orphans kind of territory and they say, you know, take off your colours and you can pass kind of thing. And I really like the idea of, you know, kind of having to strip your identity of somebody else. Yeah. So, and I felt that kind of is what the album was about sometimes in the lyrical content. Yeah, I mean, this was back in like nearly, well, nearly a year ago, wasn't it? Well, it must have been come up to like December. Yeah. Then we were on about, oh, we want to go into the studio and record in January, and everything got pushed back. And that back then, so we came up with the title. And it's always stuck. I just always really liked it. So, so the uh, the first single off the album uh, will be "Jealous," my single like, and yeah. you've just shot a video for that. Yeah. Um, what was the kind of concept behind it? Well, okay. What it's happened? quite dark. Song, it is. Really. It's a bit. It's a lot darker than all the other stuff we've done before, and I think it's just because we wanted to maybe try and step up our videos. Because um, so far we kind of felt that we just kind of. I mean, this one is very much by the book as well, but it's kind of a few levels up. The, the cameras, the camera quality is really good, and it's just more cinematic than the other one. So sure, I think it shows like more of edge of like maturity to yeah, us as well. It's cool. It's, it's different yeah. to the other videos. It's yeah. Different. But yeah, I mean, originally it was meant to be about like an alter ego, me having an alter ego, and I, I've done the acting, acting things for it, but we don't know if we're going to use it or not, we're going to see how it comes out, I think it turns out nice that we use it. But I think we're all just terrible actors. Yeah, yeah. so it looks like Hollywood. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I love Hollywood. I like Hollywood too, so thank you. Um, right. So finally, uh, we'll let, before we let you go off from there, sure. do you stretches and your lunges, um, you're up for Best British Band on Thursday at the Kerrang Awards. <laughs> Uh, what will you be doing in preparation for the night? Um, we will be making sure that it's actually happening and that it's not a joke. So I'm going to keep calling our, our press team and making sure yeah, it's not just set up. It is a set, set, set up. It's definitely a set up. Is Jeremy Beadle going to come run out? <laughs> if he does, that will be a whole other story. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't know. It's it's the weirdest thing. Like Last year when we got nominated for Best British Newcomer was weird. And this is just... We felt like... Maybe we should be up for Best British Newcomer yes, this yeah. year. It sort of yeah. came too early. And then now we feel like maybe this is coming a bit early. And, I don't know. Oh, maybe right. next year we'll be up for Icon Award. Yeah. yeah. But the thing is, I don't want people to think that we like we are so like stoked that we want to vote for us. So it's not so much that. It's just kind of some people have said, oh, you're really out of your league with the likes of Biffy and yeah. Profits and we stuff. Agree. And like we agree completely. But at the end of the day, you know, 
going to take what comes our way and we're not going to try and drink it. Yeah. Yeah. Someone yeah, can go, if you want to come to the Korean man. Man. we're not going exactly. to exactly turn it down, are we? And to be involved in the Korean shows is yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, that's cool. a big deal. So thank you. Well, Dash, John, <laughs> uh, thank you very much. Uh, enjoy the show tonight. Thank, thank you. Man.